Well, this is one of the first times I've fished this lake in probably eight months or so. Um, those of you that aren't familiar with it, it's Converse Park North or North Park, something like that. I don't know exactly what the name is, but it's definitely far from one of my favorite lakes to fish. Um, spent a ton of time fishing here and never catching anything but came out with uh, my buddy Dominic yesterday he had come out earlier in the day and caught one anyway sorry I was having some stuff there that I thought was possibly a fish Anyways, he came out yesterday during the day and caught one and uh, was pretty excited about it, which hell, I was excited about it my damn self because I've never done any good at this lake, so, you know, obviously I was going to be excited. And, uh, Damn, I got a knot in my braid. <clears throat> that's gonna limit my throws, that's for damn sure. Anyways, um, like I said, back on story being, Dom had caught one. He was pretty excited about it. He had never fished here. Uh, was pretty excited about the way it looks and I can't deny that. It's a very good looking lake. Looks like it ought to house some really decent fish, which from lure, it sounds like it is. I mean, it looks like it does from what people say and talk about. But anyway, so we came back out and I guess Dom and I were here maybe two hours and within the first 30, 45 minutes, he picked up another one. So, I thought, well, heck, I'm going to go try to fish Converse today. So here I am at Converse Park North. Um, I started in on another spot when I first turned the GoPro on and uh, fished it a bit. There were some people close to me, so I didn't really want to get in too much to talking and sound like some kind of weirdo talking to myself. So, so we're going to come down here again, and I guess we're going to toss around all this cover out here in front of us. Maybe we'll have a bass sitting in it and he'll take this lizard and eat it We got him. Boy, he put on a show for y'all, didn't he? Pretty decent looking fish. Decent looking fish. 
heck yeah. Boy, did he put on a show, man. He came up out the water sideways and forward ways and all kinds of ways for y'all. And you're going to have to excuse me. I'm trying to get my damn GoPro, I mean my pliers out of my back pocket. Anybody who was watching looked like I was digging in my ass, but... Yeah, that's a good fish. Really good fish. I like it. Like I said, man, he put on one hell of a good show. He came completely up and out of the water. Hopefully, that was all on cam. Let's see if I can get a... Yeah, I got a Dominic and Mark picture there. All right, let's put this bad boy back out here in the water. Nice and sleek back out into the pretty waters. All right, let's fix our lizard and get back out there for that again. Heck, I think that was like what, cast number two, three in this spot. And I picked that guy up. That was a nice fish. Got me pretty excited too, because only caught one little dink out of this lake in almost a year of fishing. fish this place pretty consistently but in the fish's defense I had never fished down on this end of the lake and back then I was into a whole lot of different fishing technique than what I am now I was using moving baits pretty consistently that was it I want to catch some more like that we got another little fish on well we had a fish on but I stopped reeling so I could turn the GoPro on and he got off so we'll try that again it was only my second cast in here so maybe we'll get another one Fish over there, swirling in that shallow water, way over there, over there. Another one swirling over here. They're swirling out there a lot. 
They all look like they're pretty damn big too. Damn it. Crab cast. I just cast them to there. God damn, I was digging it back and picked up this little sucker. That's probably the guy that we caught first, the first cast in here. Yeah, I was jigging it back, kind of like a moving bait. And he nailed it. <laughs> oh, ass. He's confused, he don't know where the outside water's at. Well, that's two little ones out of this spot back in here, so... We're gonna cast out again, because I'm trying to go that way. There we go. Oh, I wanted it further out than that, though. That was funny because this is all I was doing trying to retrieve it back, but I was jigging it. Kind of figured, well, since I didn't like that cast, I'll jig it back and see if I catch anything. And bam, got him. All right, I'm going to try to get around to over here. I see fish swirling over there, and I want to see if I can get to it or not. As bad as I'd like to, I'm not going to because it's real muggy and muddy and marshy back in there. So we're going to have to try to make this work from here. Well, uh, we had an unfortunate mishap. We lost our black lizard and when I left the truck all I did was just grab a few worms to bring out here with me. So, I figured since we were fishing with the lizard and it's so awkwardly weird shaped, we would try the sweet beaver. There we go. Got to run a little bit here. He's not great. He's not as good as that first one I caught, but he's a fish. And apparently they like sweet beavers out here, huh? Alright, that 
trigger won't work for me. And of course, good thing I decided to switch hands and reach in the pocket to get it because the pliers were laying down flat in my pocket. fish ladies and gents not a great fish but hell I'm just happy to be catching again let him go back in the water he sure as heck didn't want to take off very fast. He's just right there. Huh. Yeah, he didn't really get all excited. He just swam away. He liked me. He wanted to be my friend. Alright, let's do this. Back through the... About right there. There's a little skin tuck. Let's get back out there. <laughs> 